I'm Aaron Merch from 2H Media. In this video, we're going to take a look at a few simple ways to put products on sale in Shopify. From the Shopify dashboard, click on Products in the left-hand navigation. From the Products page, let's start with a basic product. On the Basic Product page, scroll down to the center of the screen and locate the Pricing section. Next, copy the current product price into the Compare at Price field. Enter the product sale price in the price field and click the Save button at the top of the screen. If you want to review how your sale product looks on the front end of your store, click the Preview link at the top of the screen. In most Shopify themes, you'll see the Compare at Price crossed out with the sale price displayed nearby. It's also very common to see the exact saving amount displayed nearby in an alternate color. Putting a variable product on sale is a little bit more complicated. So let's navigate back to the products page and select a variable product. Scroll down to the variants section and click the edit button next to the desired product variant. Once the variant page appears, you can once again copy the price into the compare at price field and enter your sale price in the price field. You can click through the available variants in the menu on the left. When you're done setting sale prices for your variants, click the back arrow in the top left corner of the variant page to return to the product page. To make sure everything's appearing correctly, we can once again click the preview button. If you've only set some of the variants on sale, you'll see that the way the price is displayed changes from variant to variant as you click through the available options. Setting sale prices can be done much more efficiently in bulk, so let's navigate back to the products page and take a look. From the products page, click the checkboxes next to any number of desired products. Within the bulk editor, you'll see that the price field and the compare at price field are both displayed, not only for each product, but also for each product variant. By going through the products and variants one row at a time, we can put them on sale just like we would on the product pages, only it's much faster because we don't have to click through individual variants. Once you've finished making changes, click the save bar at the top of the screen. And that's it. If you followed along with this entire video, you now know a few quick and easy ways to put products on sale in Shopify.